Well, this is really a pleasure this morning to welcome Maureen uh, uh, Hancock back into our studio with us this morning. Uh, good morning. How are you doing this morning? So nice to see doing you Doing great. So excited to be here. <laughs> okay. You are. So we, she is. She doesn't know she does you guys that well. Like she is. <laughs> <laughs> so, Ma- Maureen, uh, this is, we're moving right into your, uh, your sweet spot, your wheelhouse here this uh, week. Halloween is coming up on uh, Monday. Yes. Now, we classify Maureen as a renowned psych, uh, not a psychic, but a spirit medium, where she's able to contact people who've uh, passed over to the other world. Oh, yeah. Maureen, can you feel anyone calling anyone this morning? Um, yes, actually, I have a really strong vibration for these two women on the end here, um, and I feel like both mothers are trying to connect. Yeah. Um, your mothers are duking it out over who's going to come in. Um, I also hear the name Barbara. Remember that names can be living or past. If you know, do you want to come up to the microphone here? Okay, somebody That's says, so yeah, Barbara means and something. And just for the record, I have not met these women, or, you know, they just came in and... Just for the record, I've met all of them. (laughs) (laughs) How often? (laughs) They smell really nice. Uh, Good morning, and how are you this morning? How are you doing? I'm doing very good, thank you. Okay. Could we have your name? My name's Susan. Hi, Susan. Okay, good to see you there, Susan. Susan, so I felt your mother really strongly, um, and, and also... Uh, the woman sitting next to you. So, and when you're here in this room, anyone can mm-hmm. kind of pop in. Who is Barbara? Barbara is my sister who is actually very sick right now. Okay. Ooh. So, as mom comes through, for the first thing for me to hear is Barbara, Barbara, say this, Maureen, is because she knows that Barbara's sick and needs prayers. And, and every day and every night, you ask your mom for guidance. And I feel your dad behind your mother. Um, he went first. Did your yes, dad he go did. first? Okay. Yes, he did. It feels like many years before. There's also mm-hmm. an army connection that I feel, um, or the saluting. And do you know William? That's um, Barbara's husband. Oh, wow. Barbara's husband. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. See, all the energy mm-hmm. is going to Barbara and her husband and the family. And Barbara keeps a lot to herself, um, doesn't she? She does. Yeah. She, well, she had a stroke, so she can't really communicate okay. all that mm-hmm. much. That's okay. All right. So but she always you, did. Oh, yeah. So lots of love from the heavens above. Please know that they hear your prayers without a doubt. And that's why even all of these women sit on a, sitting on the couch, your loved ones stepped out of the way because of the seriousness of what's going on in this woman's really? uh, life. Yeah, it's pretty wild. And then they'll start to, to pop in as well. Uh, what is your name? Cameron. Cameron, okay. Cameron. And you yeah. say that there was a young male that was trying to reach Cameron? And Cameron's, uh, I felt, your mother as well, and mom's in spirit for you. Right. Yes. yes. And um, this younger male who passed abruptly, um, you know, possibly on the nephew level or something. Does that make sense? Yes. Okay. So wow, because right away your mother's given me the information to help um, your nephew come through. I am getting snapping of the fingers. It was very fast. I do think there were unanswered questions around his passing, like little question marks. Has it been um, a little bit of time for him, or a few years? Yes, it has. Uh, Yes. Okay. Uh, he passed away. He was um, 42. Okay. He passed away on my sister's birthday. It was oh, uh, her son. Yeah, I was just going to say oh, it has to wow. be her son. And you know what? When, when someone passes away on a birthday or an anniversary, um, I look at it as a super spiritual thing and not... I, I mean, it's a tragic loss, but um, I feel like that's their bond. While Stevie Nicks was playing... Um, what's your name? Cameron's sister-in-law started to come through, said um, she had breast cancer, and she was 43 years old, and she was 43, right? Whoa. So that even freaks me out. Right. And then um, the Dorchester connection for the woman on the end, and as I look at you, your mother comes in, you know, just very... Um, fun and gracious and everybody come to my house da, 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 da. Um, and there's something about six kids or six siblings or something and you two come together because um, when you bring a friend you bring a dead friend so I you see. know what I mean they all okay, come so out of the Volkswagen <laughs> so would you two identify <laughs> yourselves first of all your name Michelle. Michelle and? Carol. Michelle and Carol, and you guys came together, right? Yes. yes. Okay, yes. so now what, what messages are you getting So here, first, right? Carol, your mom's passed, correct? Yes. And then I, <laughs> people think I remember stuff. Mm-hmm. What's your name? The other one? I need Michelle. To buy Michelle. an avowal. Buy an avowal. Okay. <laughs> so um, both mothers are, are coming through together, and I also have a strong father um, coming through. 
uh, maybe collected coins. Um, there's a lot of coins. Do you find dimes? Yes. Carol? Yes. Dimes? Yes. Why dimes? I don't know. Sometimes they choose pennies, dimes, nickels, quarters, and they'll show up in the most random places, right? And I want you all, even the li listening audience, to look at the dates. My sister's son, who passed tragically, sends us 1984 pennies and dimes. That's the year of his birth. So... Your dad is, is just laughing, like, oh, I don't believe in this crap. <laughs> yeah, I'm with Wally. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, and, then, and Wally, your dad's in solo. Oh. Well, did your yeah. dad pass? What year did your dad pass? My dad yeah. passed in 93. You? Oh. My dad's still alive. He was all good. Okay. You're no, you're <laughs> no medium. Good? No. <laughs> you're right. hey, no, as a matter of fact, no, I got a 2013, 2013 dime right here sitting in my pocket. 2013. Okay. Anyone? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, tell me. Why? My father. Oh, somebody's so the, going. So the woman on the couch, and wh where did you come from? <laughs> I don't remember you. Traffic. you? Oh, traffic. Oh, traffic. So interesting. See, I'm a traffic reporter. So See what happened right there? This, no. <laughs> Hank, you're not oh kidding. God. It's always heavy, just like I So am. a woman just came in late to the studio audience. Hank pulls out a dime as we talk about that, 2013, asking, when did your dad pass? And that's when, what's your name? That's when Janice's dad passed. Oh, no kidding. Crazy. Janice, come up here for just a second. Would you uh, share uh, the mic here? Okay. Okay. Uh, do you feel anything else for uh, Janice? Wow. Well, Hank was doing that reading. <laughs> That's pretty amazing. I don't know what he was doing in my front pocket, but he seemed very nice and warm. <laughs> was, that oh a, my God. was that a dime or a penny, Hank? Wow. That was a dime. A dime. They were okay. talking dimes. So this wow. happens a lot, Maureen? Yes, they'll use coins. They use things of nature, butterflies, dragonflies, right? Do you get the butterflies? I and get and your mom's passed? Dimes? dimes? You get dimes a All lot? The time. What's yep. the deal? That's yeah, crazy. That interesting. And that's the woman stuck in traffic. Yeah, it took us two hours as well. <laughs> but I have a strong uh, motherly woman around you as well. And were you close to your mother's mother? Um, not I lie. Mean, she's dead and she's here. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> wow. um, not necessarily. I'm no. also hearing like a Helen or Ellen, if someone knows. And remember that can be living as well, or Evelyn. Keep it in mind when we leave here, Hank. What about you? You're you're intercepting here. Yeah, Hank. What were out. the names again? Evelyn. Ellen. Evelyn. It's a E L N. No. Ellen. How about a Joy? <laughs> no, that didn't even make That's sense. But that doesn't mean yeah. No, we just lost a close <laughs> friend. <laughs> yeah, so please know, though, but your mom from Dorchester, really, really strong mom. And your your dad kind of took over, you know, very close. Um, I feel a lot in the chest with him. Does that make sense? I can't yeah, breathe. He, he um. He drowned as he had a stroke, oh, and he yikes. drowned. Oh my, oh, my God. God. That's so unbelievable. Sorry. I could just feel like I couldn't breathe, and there was really? a lot of pressure wow. on my chest. Yeah, but he's smiling like, you know, I'm good. I'm fine. There's three kids, so the three connection that, that they want to bring up as well. That could be three of one sex. Do you know? Yes. Yep. Okay. Do you feel any of these other ladies? Are you being contacted by anyone from the uh, beyond yes, here? Yes, I need you two to step up to the plate. All right. Hey, these are members yeah. of our studio audience we who we've go. invited to come in and yeah. be with us this morning. And if you'd step right up to this microphone, and uh, mm -hmm. which, uh, good, first of all, good morning. And what is your name? Tracy. Tracy. And uh, you are? Kathy. And you Kathy. have to go Tracy. right Kathy. to the Kathy. microphone. Okay. It's like putting on chapstick. Oh, You've got to get right up there. <laughs> okay, so um, so Tracy, yes. you're Tracy, I and am. then you're Kathy. Kathy. So Kathy, your mom has been very strong. Um, she's she just goes to the beat of her own drummer. So I kind of had to wait, um, and uh, I just heard we fought the good fight, uh, just with an illness. And then it, now, is it your sister-in-law that's passed? Yes. Okay. Was she like your best friend? Well, she's saying uh, you were good very, friends. Very, very close. <laughs> well, very close. Even if they're my words, but it's a feeling that comes over me like, oh, you know, I, I know she wants to talk to me instead of her mother. So <laughs> she has a great sense of humor. This woman smiled through her pain. Absolutely. And she never, ever complained because I'm asking her, what was going on with you? And she's like, it's on a need-to-know basis, <laughs> and you don't need to know. <laughs> but I love her. She's a huge guardian angel for your daughter, Tracy. Tracy, you talk to her in the car, she says, um, just all the time. It, I don't think it's been that long for her passing. Is it a couple of years? Almost two. 
Oh, that's not wow. a couple. I'm sorry. I'm no mathlete. No, <laughs> it's two. I'm making a joke. That was a bad joke. Um, but, yeah. No, it wasn't. <laughs> but um, I really like her. And I will tell you this. Your mother planned to step out of the way so that your aunt, or aunt, as they say in <laughs> other places. Cleveland. Uh, yeah, Cleveland. Um, could come through. And she just said, I'm not sick anymore. And where did the two kids come in? She has two kids. Yeah, cause I, and I just heard, please tell my children I'm not going to miss out on their lives. I'm going to be right by their side. And, and uh, there's a medical field connection for someone as well or someone. I'm a nurse. Oh, that's wow. not medical. That's a medical field. <laughs> <laughs> see, I know people are so. I see uh, Tracy. You're like, hmm. I don't know anyone in My the medical field. My husband's a pharmacist. Okay. Oh, oh so. yeah, that's but, and your mom's a nurse, so um, <laughs> that's even better. But wow, so much love to you from the heavens above. MaureenHancock.com. Uh, the shows are fantastic, and this log on it's spelled M-A-U-R-E-E-N-H-A-N-C-O-C-K dot com. Uh, the show Friday night, November shows. You even got some December shows coming up. Uh, yes. So Maureen. It's, that's great. Thank you very much for being with us this Thank morning. Thank you all. And, oh, yes. and happy Halloween. Yes. Happy Halloween. And ladies, thanks Ooh. for being here.